Hey everyone, are you tired of black screen while gaming? Want to know how to fix the screen going black while gaming? I will be sharing very effective solution that you need to apply one by one. Make sure that you do not miss any one of them. Apply them one by one and check that which method work for you. And the very first thing that you need to assure that you check your memory, CPU and the disk usage. If there is a high usage, this is the major cause behind a black screen. So what you can do on your Windows 10 or Windows 11, right click on the Windows icon, choose Task Manager. Then here you will see all the application and here you will see the progress bar. The GPU on my end, it's 26%, memory 43, disk 0. So what you have to assure that all these three do not exceed 90%. If it's going to above 90%, and this will turn automatically to red so that is the you know like symbol of danger and not only your gaming will be affected but your program your computer will not work properly okay so to reduce it what you can do you can just close the application that is occupying a lot of space like you can see google chrome is occupying a lot of space so while gaming if i don't need it i can close it and that will surely improve the performance so for that from the top end menu click on the details tab now here look for the application that you want to close which you are not using right now make a right click on it choose end process tree similarly you have to do this for all the application and once you are done you can check back again if there is any progress or not okay and even after applying all the solution if nothing works for you if it works make sure that you hit the like and subscribe but if nothing works for you then you have to check your coolant on your cpu so no matter you are using a laptop or a desktop what you can do after applying all the solution you can carry your laptop or cpu to any local store any computer store you can ask them to put some kind of coolant on your processor this also happened because of overheating okay so even it will fix your black screen issues and even it will improve the performance and if in case if you're not using the ssd drive kindly go ahead it's very recommended that you should have a ssd drive on your pc right so once you are all done with this hopefully you understand that why i'm explaining you because these all are very important factor behind such kind of issues now the next thing what you can do the graphic card is another cause which can create a problem so you can try restarting your graphic driver you have to use a shortcut key that is windows control shift and the letter b key and once you press them all together you will see the screen will flash okay and that means the graphic driver has been restarted after that you can check again if this fix the problem and if not, then you can try restarting your Windows Explorer. So as you see a black screen on your end, then what you have to do, just press Ctrl, Alt, Delete. And you will see uh, this kind of option coming up on your screen from here. Try to open Task Manager first. If it comes up, then it's fine. From the top end menu, click on File, then click on Run New Task and type here Explorer dot exe then click on ok now if task manager is still is not coming up then again press ctrl alt delete now here you need to go with an option of sign out click on sign out and then sign in back again and check that if this fix the problem and if not the next thing that you have to do is you need to you need to disable the pci express from the power management on your search box type power cfg dot cpl from the suggestion choose this option power cfg dot cpl control panel item the power option will be coming up and now to whichever option your uh, power has been checked like in my case it's been selected to ultimate performance just on the very right of it click on change plan settings then click on change advanced power settings the power option will be coming up here you have to look for the pci express click on the plus icon to expand the options then you will see link state power management click on the plus icon again and make sure that this setting option has been set to off 
it probably it can be said to moderate power save savings or maximum power saving then you have to go with off once done click apply then click on ok now after this you also need to try updating your graphic driver chances are that your driver are not up to date and that's the reason it's creating a problem on your windows icon make a right click choose device manager device manager will be up here look for display adapters double click on it now make a right click on your graphic which will be listed below the display adapters and choose update driver then click on search automatically for drivers and if there are updates available then it will automatically update it and once updated you can try restarting your pc and check back if this fix the problem and even not then what you can else do again make a right click on your graphic card choose properties then click on the driver tab here and if you get an option of rollback driver highlighted then you can go with rollback driver okay if sometime the updated version of the graphic card also create a problem so you can go to with the previous version okay if you have already tried this and it's still not working then you can also go and uninstalling the graphic driver and then reinstalling it back so what you can do make a right click on it choose uninstall device then click on uninstall and once uninstalled you have to restart pc and this will automatically uh, reinstall the graphic card on your pc after that check back if this fix the problem and even if not you can try two more options that is disabling the game mode yes many people recommended complain that turning off the gaming mode fix their problem so you can also try that click on your search box type here gaming mode from the suggestion choose game mode settings and here it should be enabled you what you have to do you need to disable this game mode option okay disable this and the another thing that you can try that is the last option that is disabling the app readness service from your windows computer click on the search box type here services from the suggestion choose services app now here you have to look for the service app readness double click on it and make sure that this service is not running it should be stopped okay so it means you can check it here if the status shows you running then you have to click on a stop then click on apply and then on ok again you can try making a restart and check back that if this fix the problem and even if not then as recommended Kindly visit to any computer local store, ask them that they should check your CPU and the GPU and if there is any overheating issues or it's not performing well, probably they will clean it, put some coolant on it and that will surely improve your performance and fix the black screen issues from your computer. So that's all guys and if this method worked for you, do not forget to like and subscribe and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.